You want to know? We asked the experts. What would it be like to play football on Mars? Okay, there's three things. The strength of your arm, gravity, which is what ends up pulling the ball back down. There's air resistance, there's air drag, which also slows down the ball. So what's different on Mars, Yeah. your arm is the same, as it's, it's still your arm, right? But the gravity is weaker. Gravity on Mars is only like 38%. So it will go farther, okay? before it eventually hits the ground. And because there's hardly any air on Mars, air on Mars is only like 1% of the pressure of right. air on Earth, it means it will also go even further because there's less air resistance. Because it's not slowing down. Right, right, right. And when it's thrown, it will be like a perfect parabola. It will be a different shape to the flight of the football than it would on Earth because there's no air resistance. So when they say go long on Mars, you can go way they long. They mean go way long. Way long, yeah, super long. Okay. What would the band sound like? So with less air on Mars, because sound has to travel through air. Sound, sound is, is wiggling air. It's vibrating air. But on Mars, with that 1% of atmosphere of the Earth, it's going to be a lot harder for those molecules to bump into each other. So the band is going to have, a, have to play a lot louder. They could be right in front of your face, and you just hear like, nah. hardly anything. And then also because of the lower air pressure, you have that kind of teeny chipmunky sound. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. The other thing is, is that that temperature is much lower than the Earth. How cold and that's is going it on to Mars? It's colder than Minnesota in the winter. The problem is, is when instruments get really cold, their pitch changes, so they're going to be all out of tune as well. So the band is going to like really sound horrible. And it would be the best band on Mars. It would be. Could we watch it on ESPN? Yes, but you're going to have to watch it like later because Mars is really yeah. far away. Live live would be, you know, that 14 minute delay. Live. So like you see something on the TV, by the time the signal hits the Earth, it already happened 14 minutes ago. It just took radio signals 14 minutes to race across the solar system to reach the Earth. And then there are a couple days throughout the year where Mars is right behind the sun. And on opposite radio sides signals, the just, they're not gonna come through. So, so you might get all watch it out. Well, I have to watch it and read Static, it. and then yeah, it, you'll have to DVR it. Would Brutus catch fire in his costume? Brutus actually has an advantage because he has so much more insulation around his head, his head won't freeze. Potentially. I haven't studied this, but Brutus's costume might be an effective Martian spacesuit. Attach some oxygen in there so, so he can breathe. He's insulated. It might be sealed enough that it could provide enough high pressure to, to resist that low pressure Martian environment. So in other words, you're saying that Brutus really is a Martian. You, oh no. I'm saying that in 40 or 50 years, when NASA sends people to Mars, Brutus will be the first person on Mars.